It's the original World War, and the French are knee-deep in trenches, mud, and existential dread. Georges Filtz, an inventor with a penchant for both tractors and croissants, had an epiphany. He looked at his trusty farm tractor and thought, what if we slap some armor on this bad boy and send it through enemy lines? And thus, the Filtz armored tractor was born. The Filtz tractor wasn't just any armored vehicle, it was the James Bond of tractors. It had a secret weapon, electric power. This baby was fed by cables, like a giant lawnmower plugged into the matrix. The idea was to put a few tons of armor on a tractor, flip it around so the big wheels are in front, and use it to plow through barbed wire obstacles. But they couldn't move very well. You couldn't really see where you were going. And while normal tractors were made to cross muddy fields, this one weighed just a wee bit more and kept getting stuck in the barbed wire it was supposed to cross. So it mostly hung out behind the lines, towing artillery and heavy equipment. 